best new thing in the world. This is the U.S. Coast Guard Cutter Eagle. It's one of what they call the tall ships. Tall ship is just a name that they give to big, traditionally rigged ships that are powered by the evil communist green energy source known as wind. Ginormous sailing ships. The Coast Guard Cutter Eagle normally lives at the Coast Guard Academy in Connecticut, but this week it is in New York City as part of Fleet Week. Fleet Week is when the Navy and the Marines and the Coast Guard all come to New York City. They parade their ships through the Verrazano Narrows and up the Hudson River, and all week long, if you happen to find yourself in a New York City bar, there is a pretty good chance you are going to end up buying a beer for a stranger who was wearing some very nice white pants. This year, to celebrate the 200th anniversary of the War of 1812, do the math, uh, Fleet Week includes not just all the modern warships, but also 17 massive restored tall ships, these giant sailing vessels, including the Eagle, which led the parade of warships into New York Harbor this year. The Eagle gets to do stuff like this because it is known as America's tall ship. It's the largest tall ship that flies the Stars and Stripes. But here's the thing. Even though it is America's tall ship, the Eagle has not always been all that American. The ship used to be called the Sagal Schulschiff Horst Vessel. Say that three times fast. The SSS Horst Vessel was originally commissioned in Nazi Germany and named after a stormtrooper who died in a street brawl. Adolf Hitler was present for her original launch in 1936. She was used to train cadets in the German Navy. The reason we've got this ship now is because after World War II, we took her as a war prize, renamed her the Eagle, and now she serves as an international goodwill ambassador for the United States, as a training tool for the Coast Guard Academy cadets, and as a giant, mizzen-masted, square-rigged, neener-neener to the Nazis. Nice. The best new thing in the world today. She is, uh, by the way, if you are in driving distance of New York City or you're here already, uh, that ship is docked at Pier 90 on 47th Street. If you want to go see her, you can just walk right up and take a look. That does it for us tonight. We will see you again tomorrow night. Now it's time for The Last Word uh, with Lawrence O'Donnell. Thanks for being with us tonight. Have a good one.